He's just standing there taking all these uh, snowballs. Poke the goblin. Yeah. This is a Christmas game. It's about saving Christmas. Seems kind of vague, but... Thimble, I thought I got you. Yay, we have the bro shared one more time. Thanks, you were a huge help. Now we can head back to my dad. I do like her winter coat though, it's, it's nice. We have to go back now. My Chloe is back. Thank you. I'm always willing to help Jim. I'll give you the rest of the money. The Dillinghams are good people. I'd hate to see them suffer on Christmas Day. Wow, another bag of gold, folks. $50,000 bag of gold he just happens to have. Uh, no, I have not played Pokemon Sun or Moon. All right, folks, we now have $100,000. Where are we going? What are we doing? Who's coming with? Okay, drop it off, I guess. We just throw it in here. The Dillinghams will be just fine now. Jim and Della really love each other. And they have great friends who wanted to help them in their time of need. That's what I call Christmas spirit. Another pretty toy for my tree. Oh, but you must be lonely. Don't worry, there's still plenty of room for your brother. <laughs> I never doubted that you could help the Dillinghams, Oliver. I'd like to present you with a piece of magic power for your sphere. Okay. But there's another person in this town who desperately needs your help. My magic can send you there, but you must find them and help them on your own. Okay, Jack. Alberta is definitely a little creepy. Creepy! It's the tailor shop. Who's napping in the corner, I wonder? Napping. <gasps> Gingerbread house. <gasps> Somebody picked off the candies. It's not comfortable to sleep atop a book. How many of you have eaten a gingerbread house? Look at this thing. Oh, like little candy canes and jelly beans and oh my gosh, jelly tots or whatever those things are called. So good. It does sound a little bit like uh, Lenny Manella voice actress for the, uh, the the nemesis here this tree is uh, super decorated it's got giant acorns and giant bows oh yeah you've had these in the past it's like everything is made out of pure sugar and gingerbread <laughs> so delicious whoa 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 who's here why is the mouse dressed up? Why does the mouse have clothing on? What's required to complete this job? I want some thread. I want some bells. Candles almost melted away, but this flame can still light something. Huh. Sleeping on the job. Yeah, he's got work to do. No such luck for that. What about over here? Uh, I can't make out what's on the cupboard. It looks like the bulb is missing a light. <gasps> Little rascal! Did you see that one was in PGAs? 
Aww. You haven't had a chestnut on open fire? The Morphor is on the shelf. There you go. Thank you. Mm -mm -mm. So I now have a diary key. Let's open up this diary. Oh. There. Swapsies. Find out what's in his diary. This tailor shop is the legacy of my family, passing from father to son for many generations. Mm -hmm. Now it's time for me to take over dad's shop. But recently, we haven't been getting any orders. I'm worried. I finally got an order from a local rich man. He wanted a finely embroidered caftan. He provided everything, even gemstones and golden thread. I set to work immediately. The unthinkable has happened. All my supplies have disappeared, and I don't have enough money to replace them. The deadline is tomorrow, but I have nothing to show my client. What if he shuts down my business? Will my cat Simkin and I lose our home? I'm not giving up. I've run all over town gathering supplies for the caftan. Okay. What would be the town? Oh. There must be some spare buttons and thread in my shop as well. Buttons. I need to restore my caftan sketch. I've got everything but the golden clasps. My neighbor the jeweler has some, but they're too expensive. Oh no. What are we gonna do? Hmm. Wait. Am I still looking for a golden clasp? Dude, do you have nothing better to do yeah. than to eat candy at Keen's? Uh, where's... Father raised oh. me to treat others with respect, kindness, and love. I've never offended anyone, not even a mouse. But yet, I still ended up like this. I've ruined my father's shop and I've disgraced my family. I could use some kindness myself. I like the story exposition here. This is really nice. Peter lost several items required for the rich man's caftan and needs my help to restore it. Those are fancy. Yes, he needs one thousand hundred thousand dollars too. <laughs> Lose something, Peter? <laughs> Maybe Peter needs half a million dollars, so we're gonna have all sorts of bags of gold. I feel like the hundred thousand dollars is worth more than a couple gold clasps. I don't know. Call me crazy. Just make sure you call me. Alright, pulsating cube. You would crochet all that yarn, would you? <gasps> Connect the dots? Seriously? I can do connect the dots. Oh, it's a kitty cat and a mouse. It's Tom and Jerry. Come on, then. We did it! Yay! He is a witch for sure. Connect the dots. It was fun actually. Not too stressful. I. Oh yeah, so this is where I have to gather up all the bits. Maybe that little mouse lady is gonna help me. <gasps> this guy, isn't he from one of the previous uh, Christmas Story games? Simkin, where are you going? Silly Simkin. What you doing there, buddy? Tom and Jerry, exactly. Oh, what else is in here? One out of five of those. Like, look at the Christmas in the art here. Wow. This game looks fantastic. We're not able to do either of that stuff. Oh, there's our collectible. 
I don't know the story of Box of Delights. Okay, so we're gonna have to get Cherub. This guy looks totally familiar to me. Hmm. Okay, so that bell is probably gonna go back here. Ah, we're not ready yet. We need more bells. Oh, we can go over and put this horse over here. I think that might be Talking Tom, yeah. We need more lights, please. Sparkler! We can light it. I'm not sure why we need it, but... <laughs> we have a lit sparkler. Let's light it up. Aw, now I'm sad. I am sad. Oh, we can light the candle. We just melted something. Grab whatever was in there. This cutie has lost a hoof. We got puzzles. Hmm. That there. What else we got? It's a treble clef. It's gotta go there. Yeah! Open says me. Going into the bedroom. So Simkin brought me here and here he is on the bed. Simkin, what are you doing on the bed? Turkish Game Media, hello! Welcome, welcome. Dude! Dude, read my comments, please. Read. <laughs> I'm uh, live streaming across Twitch, Hitbox, YouTube. I can see all the comments. Thank you for hanging out with me today. No, 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 no. Get out of there. This mouse seems to have useful information for me. Maybe Peter's list. But first, it wants to test me. I don't want to be tested. Wow, there's like mouse all over the place here. Or mice. Whatever. This guy needs to get an exterminator. <coughs> Meow! Why don't you actually chase the mice there, <coughs> cat? <laughs> Lazy kitten for sure. Oh, uh, puzzle pieces. What do we have? What do we see? I should carefully move the rose bush. Well, I'm not ready for that yet. Let's glue something. Apparently, we're going to make Mr. and Mrs. Claus. Apparently. Oh no, that is actually going to be Santa. Never mind. Yes, we are being tested by a mouse. <gasps> These are all the Santas? These are all the different Santas? Wow! Which one is your Santa? I want to know. Do you have this Father Christmas, the Santa? I'm not sure what the Mexican one's called. Are these all of your Santas? Aw, oh, we're posing the Santas! Hey! <laughs> so good. Father Winter? Winter Father? Something like that. We now have a little apron. Oh, it's adorable. Mm -hmm. Hey. Let's do this. What else would maybe he would like a little apron to? <gasps> Why? Why do you have a little apron? He's a cleaner. <laughs> okay. Why? What are you cleaning, boy? Don't know. Whoa, little mouse. Your Santa? Which one's your Santa? They're all the same fictional character, right? Spoiler alert. Father Christmas. Uh... Okay, so 